100 days in a nuclear war. Over the past few hundred days, our server has been engulfed into war and chaos. With each defeated base of our enemies, the outlaws, is one step closer to wiping them out once and for all. Our last encounter with the outlaws left their base in ruins and beyond repair. All the wars and battles fought on the server have been recorded by Sword, so this link will be in the description for a different perspective. With no sign of the outlaws for a while, we built up a fortified village off the grid. Here we could farm, collect resources, and live in peace for the time being. With this break from warfare, the admins decided to remove various rare ores, used for making guns and ammo. But this came at a cost. As we were known on the server to be the richest, it meant that enemy teams would scout us out in search of our wealth. The outlaws managed to sneak into our base past our defences and take a look around. And the day after, a whole army of outlaws had turned up at our base, using their full force. We were quickly made aware of the situation and we prepared and got onto the walls to defend. Which side is it? That one. West, did you say? We were instantly overwhelmed by the sheer number of soldiers they had at our walls. However, this was our home ground and we were not going to give it up. Wait, this is, um, this is southeast actually. Yeah. Guys, get down. Southeast, I don't see them. Oh, There's shit. so many. They hid in the trees, taking cover where they could. However, it wasn't long before they built up and infiltrated our base. Oh, they're, they're, in, they're in the wall. Yeah, they're not the same armor too. Has anybody got uh, flint and steel or something? Oh my god, they're completely on the walls. Their full force was now roaming around on our walls and had direct access to our base. We need to push them back a little bit. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, Barry, I'm getting hit. Yeah, behind us, behind us. Our team was split up, with myself and Dan being pushed by the main chunk of their force. Oh my god. Push back, push oh back. Oh my god, I just survived that. This guy's, in, this guy's in between us. Oh. Oh my god, there's so many behind us. Oh, shoot. We decided to make our stand at one of the towers, where we could use cover to our advantage. No, no, push back, push back, push back. Uh, we're getting chased by like four of them. <laughs> okay, drop down into the walls if you have to. Oh, they're coming from both sides on us. Are, are, they, are they our people or not? Our no, they're not our people. We're getting no, cornered. Okay. We're getting pinned. We held our ground, being pushed from both directions and we were starting to win the battle. We were picking off a few of their members at a time. I killed one, I killed one, I killed one! Boys, I'm out of the tree, I'm sorry. It's alright. Like they're on the edge. Oh yeah, there's one here as well. I killed another one! Nice, nice, nice. Oh my god, I'm almost dead, I'm almost dead. At this point, we just about either killed or knocked off all their members on this side of the wall. And this gave us the chance to meet up with the rest of our team. The enemy team started to become disorganised, with lots of their members going solo. Then, out of nowhere, a missile was launched straight at our wall, destroying all of it and setting the place alight. They were clearly prepared for the attack. Look at that side of the wall over there! East! Oh, east. east wall! Go, go, go. Oh, the whole wall is going down. Get him, yeah, get him, get him. Is done. Myself and Sword built up to the top of the walls to get a better view of where the enemy team was. Yeah, oh, I see, I see, oh, all, I see them. Of them all, all of them. All of them. Underneath, do you see them, Reese? Oh yeah, my see. god, yeah. Wait, Barry, let's drop down here. Wait, 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 wait. Open a hole here, and let's get ready to drop on the heads when they walk through. You ready? Alright, yeah, three, two, one, go. Go, go, go. Oh, oh yeah, there they are. I see them on. We jumped back inside the walls and rushed the remaining outlaws. There were only a couple of them left at this point, and while we rushed from one side, our teammates took them from the other. They fled and jumped off the walls, but we were not going to let them get away, so we jumped after them to secure the kills.
Oh! That is, uh... They were clearly not happy with this defeat and instantly sent in another missile, taking out a large chunk of our wall. Oh, oh, they're all down there. Who's that? That's another team. Oh, there's another team. It's, it's not even them. They're using yeah, Marine. Another team turned up wearing Marine gear. We had no clue which team this was, so we assumed they were new allies of the Outlaws. There's like six of them over. I found a ladder. I'm coming up. Our whole wall's pretty much gone now. Well, I'm on two sides. Yeah, oh wait, they're, they're here, they're here! Help me, help me. They're on the wall. On the wall, right, I'm coming up. This new team had got the surprise on us, walking straight through and onto our walls. However, this team seemed to be a small force with not too much firepower, and we started to kill them off quickly. Yeah, Did they drop? Where'd they all go? Oh! Get him, get him! He's dead, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Where are they gone? Are they, is he still on the weak he's, he's on me in the trees, he's on me in the trees. Nice. Jeez. This new team was wiped out, but we had no time to celebrate. Oh, oh, very nice. What is that? What? Oh, God. The air raid siren was going off, which could only mean one thing. A nuke was coming directly for our base. Without hesitation, all our members fled straight to our bunker. The nuke went off, and the radiation spread across our lands. After a while of waiting, I went out with a hazmat suit on to check the damage and report back. Oh, good luck. Look. Can you see? Hey, boy. But yeah, I can see. Boys, crowd around me. Look at this screen here. You probably can't see it. Uh, we absolutely can. Um, do you see this? Yeah, I see this. They've got our whole town here. Look, it's, it's all radiated blocks. Oh my god, the whole thing's up in flames, right? Our whole base and around for hundreds of blocks was covered in radiated blocks. We were going to have to change how we lived if we wanted to survive in this nuclear wasteland. We got to work flattening all the land and breaking all the destruction so we could start from a fresh canvas. We then built up a few nuclear domes with decontaminators to act as our new base where we could start adapting to our new environment and where no one would think to find us. After a few days of living in the dome, we were called to a meeting by the team leader Sword. He explained that while searching for trees and resources, he came across a mysterious base in the mountains, not too far away, and proposed that we went and take a look. So that's what we did. We set off out of our new base, all in hazmat suits, to scout out this mysterious base. This base was quite deep into the mountain, and seemed to be quite empty. We crawled towards the door, trying to be as stealthy as possible. When we opened the door, we were greeted by an empty room, with no one to be seen. Is it clear? Yeah. Oh! That is not ideal. Right, yeah, watch out. Yeah, but they're probably gonna hear that. But they're gonna know, yeah, they're gonna know someone's here. Well, the top right. bit's clear, yeah. is, is this bit clear? Yeah. Yeah, this part's clear. Right, wait, right. Don't, don't drop down, don't drop down, yeah. We headed down the very small spiral staircase. There, there, there's a laser, there's a laser. On that, on that bit there. The camera's there. I don't see anyone though. Do you not see that red laser pointer? Oh no, there is someone, there's someone behind this door. Right, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna drop some smokes and then I'm gonna go for that door. This was the same enemy team that had attacked our base and who were allied with the outlaws. We knew we had to attack and wipe them out. Right, I'm gonna throw another smoke, watch out. Oh, wait, someone's run. Someone Who's running? Go, 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 follow him, follow him. Yeah, what? Gonna have to go. We charged in and pushed them out of the room, sending them running down a corridor. Watch out, watch out, whoever's there. You can shot we threw roll. in a smoke grenade and waited for a good opportunity to rush in once more. Can hear it rolling. There we go. Right, it's there gone. Go. All right, right. My, it should have them. Oh, 
Oh, so who's gone down there? Oh my god, madman, whoever just ran down there. <laughs> oh, who's down there? Oh, we got one, we got one. Go on, LK. Make a run for it so I can see what's going on. There's two dead down here. We rushed in, trying not to shoot our own members. They seemed to be in a chemical plant area, which could have been their means for making nukes. Alright, pu pu push into the chemical room. Just check behind the machines about the people hiding. We searched the room, trying to find any of their team hiding to evade the slaughter. Oh! Oh! There's oh yeah, they're the back job. behind the lasers, behind the lasers. Hold off, hold off from the chemical room. Hang a few times? Yeah, yeah, hold off in here. There didn't seem to be many people living in this base, and their number was dwindling fast. Wait, we back. I'm all out of flashbangs and stuff. What's this staircase down here that's not gonna wait? There's another person. It goes to the same place. It's where they come from. Oh, there's two people. Oh, if you lie down here, they can't, oh, they can't really get us. They can't yeah, there's us. another one there. Oh, Ryan died. I'm no. Dead. I'm dying. Alright, let's move down. Let's move down. Let's go. Right, I'm going through here. There's another room to the left. Oh, oh what? no, I'm over here. I got I'm clearing this other room out right now. Oh, no. Oh, one just run through to me. Okay. I need more stems. I only got seven. Barry, have you got yeah, that other door? That laser. Yeah, I'm on half heart. Hold on. I'm coming up. Oh, that's real flashing, that's real flashing, watch out. We had managed to push them to the very last room in this bunker, where we managed to take out the rest of their team with very little loss of life on our side. They're pushing forward. I got one. One's dead, one's dead, one's dead. All right, let's push the other guy. That's Vic, Vic's dead. Be careful not to shoot each other. Nice. Oh. He's down. That's everyone. Right, clear the room. Make sure everyone, no one else is in here. There's one more dead here. Oh, that's one of us, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was great. Well done, guys. So now, one of the enemy teams had been defeated, and we now had control over their base and all their valuables inside, including a chemical plant and various machinery. We walked home in victory. Now, with this momentum, we didn't want to stop there. We went back to our base, gathered as many weapons as we could, and headed out to wipe out the outlaws. We knew of an old camp base where they'd been seen in the past. This was our best bet of where they were hiding. So we headed out once more to our last and final battle. This was all or nothing, and either way one team was going to emerge victorious. We stepped up onto a mountain which overlooked their base, and sure enough, there they were, all the bandits in hazmat suits. We wasted no time and jumped off the mountain to move closer to the base. Their trenches lined up outside their base which we assumed they were going to use to defend their base but instead we use it to our advantage. They had clearly seen us coming as they get all their team positioned onto the roof of their base. The war had begun. Virtually all the outlaws were on top of the roof without much cover, which made them a lot more vulnerable. We got our snipers and tried to land as many shots as we could. The sniper is not accurate. <laughs> We decided to rotate around to the left of the base, where we could get more cover by a hill. Yeah. We can get them off that roof, that big mountain there. They're going to have to push that mountain in front. Diving here. I'm moving forward behind the trees. Yeah. Use, everyone use the trees. They're on. They're on the. They're on the mountain. They're on the top of the mountain. Yeah, yeah, they are. I'm on a roof as well. Let's try and snipe some of them. The enemies got to the high ground first and now had control of the mountain. Oh, there's a lot of them. They're all stacked. Oh! Oh, oh Rex dead. One down, one down. Oh, there's a guy here. I died. Oh. That's, that's why I'm that's why Rex died. There was a guy up there. Bodies were piling up on the mountain and it was becoming impossible to take it over. The outlaws had a strong hold on the mountain, and seemed to be shutting down every attack that we tried against it. 
One of our teammates had bought grenades with them, and we decided we would blow parts of the mountain to either kill or knock the enemies off. Oh, 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 oh. The grenades scared the enemies off, and we took our chance to take control. You've got to push that mountain. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they're all on the roof of the base. Yeah, they've left the mountain, they've left it. They're off this one. With control over the hill, we were able to suppress the enemies on the roof, and a lot of them were fleeing to the courtyard. I got one, I got one, I got one! A few of our members and I decided to loop round to the other side of the base to blow in from the back and surprise them. Oh, you opened it, you opened it for us. Right, okay, nice. A lot of the outlaws caught onto the situation and headed to confront us. Back up here, boys. Oh, back up here. Oh, one's outside, one's outside on the right. I got one! Got one! Nice. Bobby 06. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're all inside of there right no. now. I'm putting a grenade at the back of the barn, watch out. Oh, crap. Watch out, watch out. Go, 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 spray. I'm gonna get, get the inside, get inside. Oh, There's decontaminant. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, I see him there. I'm gonna stand on the decontaminate for a second. Throw grenades. I just threw three grenades up there. They're gonna run out. Whatever no, this is, I don't know who is it. Come on, guys. I'm out. I'm out. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. Oh, I'm out. With us in the base, they were all disorganized and they weren't sticking together. He's, he's in the tunnel. He's in the tunnel. So the tunnel. Yeah, yes, we got him. We got him. Nice. Nice. Yeah. They're they all up there. They're all, yeah, they're all up in the tower, yeah. I'll throw grenades up. Really bad. Alright, good, 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 good. Grenades in. Oh, grenades in. I don't know if that grenade's gonna fall. I think, yeah, it did, it did, it did. Oh. Cut down, cut down. Two are done. Oh, they're in the hole, they're in the hole. They're in the grenade hole, yeah, that's worked perfectly. There's a guy still up there. One's dead, one's dead. He's down there. Oh, come on. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. I'm going up. Oh, yeah, go. Good enough. Nice shot, whatever that was. He's dead, the socket dead. And just like that, the whole outlaw team was gone. After hundreds of days fighting against them in the air, underground, and through nuclear wastelands, we had finally brought peace to the server. This meant that we could all return back to farming and playing the game normally, without the fear of being attacked or killed every day. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.